breathing in, there is awareness of breathing in. Breathing out, there is awareness of breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. In, out. Insufferable feelings. Anger, part two. When a painful past strikes again. As a child, many of our wants, desires, and cravings went unfulfilled, simply because our curious yet narcissistic ego wanted just about everything, and, of course, could not have. Now, when adult wants, desires, and cravings go or remain unsatisfied, others block our abilities to attain what we want, or the ego wants, or life itself fails to grant us our often petty demands, anger typically becomes the default reactivity because the pain and suffering associated with thwarted wants desires, and cravings from the past remains unresolved today. Caged Since some of us, as well as most narcissists, experienced shunted emotional development during childhood, our or their overall emotional intelligence remains almost infantile if not primitive, as adults, reactivity to triggered and, thus, unresolved pain typically become childish displays of rudimentary anger, just as it would for any wounded, cornered, or trapped animal in threatening situations. How to make a positive out of a negative. Although almost purely unintentional as a child, when we threw temper tantrums or pitched screaming and crying fits until we got what we wanted, or at least until our parents caved to appease us, negative reinforcements, caretakers acquiescing to our emotional demands, ended in positive outcomes, our momentary satisfaction. Conditioned many of us to both administer as well as accept negative means to achieve positive results or even consequences. Conduct Unbecoming When supposedly grown and mature adults become angry and resort to breaking objects, using profane language, blaming others for what they did to me, or storm off in a great huff, among many other classic reactions, understand how such behaviors are nothing more than their still immature inner child throwing, perhaps yet another, temper tantrum. <laughs> 